the Pipistrel Electro Alpha. This will be a series of uh, films, training films, that will take you through the basics of flying the Electro aircraft. So, um, let's get started. We have now Master and Avionics on and we'll start the powertrain. So, as far as uh, everything is concerned, up to this point everything has been very normal. So, basically Master Avionics on, you start up the radios and this is it. Now, let's take a look at the uh, engine monitoring system. We have it here on the right and for items that you have to monitor is state of charge. In this case, it's 55% and you have to monitor or uh, motor temperature, inverter temperature, and battery temperature. Now, for takeoff, it's especially important that the battery temperature should be uh, as little as possible. If you're using a fast charger, it should be uh, less than 30 degrees Celsius because this will give you the necessary um, uh, endurance. Okay, now we go into more details and we now check that both battery packs, so the first and the second, are ready. Um, the throttle at this point, when the power enable and throttle enable uh, switches are off, is unoperative. So it's not good practice to move it, but if you move it, there is nothing that this throttle does at this time. So let's start with the with the startup, and the startup uh, is much much simpler than piston engine aircraft. So you just go power enable, and we check that both. Uh, battery packs are on, so we have both the front pack and the rear pack, they are active, and throttle enable on. So here we are. Now you can see some slight movement of the, uh, of the propeller, and uh, the crazy thing about flying electric aircraft is that it does not, when you have throttle at idle, it does not turn, so any time that you're holding, it does not turn. And the key point on in flying battery, uh, battery equipped or electric aircraft is that um, you have to be quick. So there is no warm up, there is no, you, we are just ready to go. So let's go. Um, we'll do the power checks later and here we go. Anytime we move uh, the throttle level, it just goes from zero to something. So, okay, here we go. We will start to roll. It takes about 7, 5, 10 kilowatts of power to get rolling. It depends on the uh, condition of the surface. But uh, here, this is it. Okay, uh, we are approaching uh, holding position. So, we'll stop here. And anytime we go uh, throttle at idle, the propeller stops moving, and this is the way it should be. So, power checks. We don't have to wait for any temperatures, we just do it uh, relatively rapidly, and we go to full power, and ensure that it reaches at least 55%. So we even got a bit of brake slip because it reached 70 kilowatts, so that's fine. Okay, the takeoff checks are very simple, so parachute pin is out, the uh, doors are closed, flaps to one, brake is released, throttle is set to idle as it should be, power, uh, master avionics, uh, power enable and throttle enable is on, QFE is set to zero, we have good temperatures, we have state of charge which is okay, and here we go, we have both battery pack active, so we're ready to go. Um, this is it, this was the training video for ground operation of the electric aircraft. Remember, be quick and it's okay for the propeller not to be turning or turning very slightly.